What's a poppin' Pisces? I'm Laurel, and welcome to Love Pisces in this mother sucker, baby. Join me as I read you you all's lives. Thank you to everyone who was liked, shared, commented, subscribed to my channel. Baby, you already know I appreciate each and every single one of you Pisceans. Yes, I do. And if you need to get a personal reading from me, you already know, hit that description box down below and check out my website, laurelsmoon.com, for any other magical purposes and deviation workings and things of that nature. So, Pisces, you already know what it is. I want a motherfucking ankle and but chocolate on in that algorithms. We about to find out how this person feels about you and what they have to say. Okay, so your ass better be lighting up, smoking up, talking up, and drinking up, and kicking your Piscean motherfucking feet up, baby. Because we about to see what this person feel about you, what they have to say. Y'all see the motherfucking title in this biatch. So Pisces. Let's get down on the motherfucking buggy. This is going to be for my sun. Moon. Rising. Venus. Penis. North node. And also for my south node. And for my Mars. Let's see what's up, Pisces. Now, hopefully I ain't got to get no disclaimers out in this motherfucking video. Okay. Because I am going to be talking about your partner, your person, your daddy, your mama, your uncle, your brother. Yo, shoulda, woulda, coulda, 50-50s, half-nots, possibly's. Nigga, I don't know. I just like that. I don't like that. Shit. Whatever the case may be, Pisces. If your ass is sensitive, gonna click the fuck on off. If your ass is on some hating ass shit, gonna take that shit up with your motherfucking mama. Okay. Now, y'all know how I do on this channel to all of my OGs, baby. You know I love you. And to all of my new subbies, welcome home. So, Pisces, let's see what it do. Spirits, you are welcome in to this Piscean reading. You must sage the cards for all of my Piscean gods. All right, Pisces. So we're going to feel how they feel about you. Okay. And then we're going to see what they really want to say that they don't tell your motherfucking ass. And okay, y'all know how I do. That being said, I'm getting my musical cards out. Okay. About how they feel about you. So give it to me for my Pisces. Next couple of days. Give it to me for my Pisces. Here we go. We got Evanson's Bring Me to Life. Uh-oh. So I don't know if this person's trying to get you to pump some sort of <laughs> that ice box where your heart used to be. This motherfucker, <laughs> this motherfucker feel like you need to bring him back to life. Okay, I don't know if you're coming up out your motherfucking casket for the dick. Okay, for the pussy. Whatever the case may be, this person definitely wants you to awaken them. Okay, in all of their senses. Now, we got everybody dies. J. Cole, damn. Okay. Very interesting energy. Then we got Computer Love by Roger Zapp. So they definitely feel like uh, y'all could have met on the computer or some sort of website. But some of you guys, I'm also scared that some of you guys, this person feels like they need to have some sort of friendship or there could be some sort of competition for their friendship. Ain't no fun if the homies can't have none. Nigga, what's going on in these cards? 
last read the same shit. Okay. So they feel like shit. Don't get so too. Huh? They got human nature by Michael Jackson. Oh my goodness. Okay, so something that's just natural or something like that. Okay, and then we got Nas, no bad energy. So this person feels like you don't want no negative energy around your motherfucking ass. Okay. Mm mm, baby. And then we got single for the night, little one. <laughs> So this person feels like you just, uh, you know, you might be single or this might be for a few nights, a few girls. Single for the night, little man. And then we got night nurse by Isaac Gregory, baby. Gregory Isaac. Tag. I also feel like you fancy or something like that. We got body party and come up by Pimp C. Dang. Well, they feel like you want to come up. Some of y'all might be pimping. Oh. Uh, bitch, I told you. Yeah. Okay, body party. Okay, somebody got a nice body. Something could be being done to your body. We also have slow down as well, too. So this person feels like you need to tell somebody to slow down or they need to slow on down. And then we got on the run by Beyonce and Jay-Z. Pisces. I'm also getting um, somebody feels like some sort of prize or there could be a prize here okay or that you give them motherfucking life every time you come around them shit whether you singing breathing shit walking shit okay so let's see what the karmic cards have to say and then we're gonna see what they got to say here we go listen to me for my pisces how do they feel? Got unknown. Oh, shit. And bones. Could be something old or a bone to pick with or something like that. But we got divination. Uh-oh. So they see you definitely in your magical power. And then we got blood. And charge. Okay. Moon and stars. Yeah, so something is definitely heavenly here. Shit, bitch, you know. Okay. We got love spell. <laughs> love and hate and dark heart. So, this person feels like they, you either have a love and hate relationship with them or there's something that's definitely over. Okay, and you got soul tire here. And, and long road home. Okay, or there's something very, very long and location spell. And voodoo dolls, like it's something you control or something, baby. Wow. You also got back door and going crazy. So this person definitely feels like there could be something in the back or could be something about your occupation, okay? Or something about going crazy at your occupation or what you do for your occupation might be a little different than the norm. All right, but we do have occupation here. So I don't know if this is somebody you can work with or your job is uh, is very unusual or this could be, you know, something that's a, got a stigma to it or something like that. Okay. So let's see what's up. Give it to me for my Pisces. We're going to get these golden girls popping. Here we go. Give it to me for my Pisces. What, how do they feel about my Pisces? 
All right, we got the Knight of Wands here. So this could be somebody who's on the go. You ready to go. Okay, this also could be uh, somebody's traveler or somebody who could be traveling here. Okay, or somebody who's coming from a distance. You also have the Temperance Energy in the Tower. Strength Energy, Queen of Wands. So they definitely see you have a lot of patience. This also could be a friendship or something like that. But I'm also getting for some of you guys with this Ten of Wands energy here. There could be a lot of work environments or this could be your occupation or you guys might be carrying a lot of energy around that could be very messy okay or there could be some mess that's around two of pentacle energy here and also ace of cups so they definitely feel like it's like they feel like it's some block communication or something like that ace of swords or somebody feels blocked like a motherfucker okay like they on the block party Straight up. Okay, like they can't get through to you. You also have the Knight of Pentacle energy here. Seven of Wands as well. And Knight of Swords. Okay, so they feel like, shit, you're going to take your time whether you like it or not, motherfucker. <laughs> Straight up. So let's see what they have to say. What do they have to say to my Pisces? We got the high priestess coming out. So they know that you know the truth. You're the seeing all, knowing all. So whether you got somebody in the back, they got somebody in the back. Okay? They know you know. Okay? Whether you hide money or not. Page of Wands energy here. All right? So they definitely want to tell you, shit, I'm locked up in either a situation with multiple people or this could be uh, something where I got to put a whole bunch of criticism with multiple people that's watching or staring or putting on, being put on display or some shit like that. Devil energy here, also Knight of Cups and Eight of Pentacles as well. So they definitely feel like you just keep on working or something. But you also got the five of wands here with this nine of swords. So they want to tell you that they know it's some multiple people or parties or there's something going on here with this person's self-esteem or something like that. Nine of swords. I mean, look how she holding her head and shit. So this person will tell you, bitch, I'm having headaches and shit. I might be sick as well. Damn. Six of Pentacle energy here. Okay, also Devil. So it could be a possible Capricorn Leo. Okay, or I'm getting Eddies and water here. Two of Cup coming out. Also, Knight of Swords, Hierophant, and Seven. You got the Hierophant. So this person definitely wants to tell you, bitch, I'm struggling, shit. I might be locked up as well, too. Okay, three of swords as well. So I feel like somebody's definitely desperate or could be very lonely here. So let's see what else they have to say. Because somebody might be sad or they sick or something like that or... Mm-mm, baby. Okay. No bad energy. Straight up. So what else do they have to say to my Pisces? We got a tap. Okay, and crab. So somebody's attacked by the crab and going crazy. That's what they telling you, shit. Bitch, I'm crazy. They already put my fucking uh 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 American Psycho. Shit. I might be going crazy over you or something. Shit. We got pests and cold world here. So somebody could be struggling within a situation or uh, somebody could be feeling like it's a very pesty situation where they got too much shit going on in the background. Ain't nothing they can control. Okay, we got in your face and seductive. So they definitely want to tell you, shit. I'm living on the motherfucking edge, okay? And I got a whole bunch of pestiness going on living on the motherfucking edge. And I'm crazy. True serum. 
So something is definitely coming in perfect timing or something is happening to this motherfucking perfect time is what they want to tell you. Here we go. We got poison. So they want to tell you it's too much shit going on. We got crash and poison. Damn. tell you they about to crash a motherfucking burn here. They're trying to be too greedy. Damn, you know, sometimes when I be reading the cards, I be reading uh, shit. I know this shit gonna be play out for me too. And I'm like, oh, fuck. Okay, we got snitches get stitches. And on that gas, and we talking. So somebody is definitely like pressing something or trying to press on something. We got what you gonna do about it? Okay, they definitely want to tell you it's a message or some. Somebody got a message for you. We got foreign and ball clap. Also switch up and level up within a week. So somebody could be switching up within a week or something like that. And then we got incognito on black sheep. What else do they have to say? So they say that they gotta keep to themselves. Yeah. Keep shit on the hush hush. We got alien invasion and goofy. And skills. And shit's about to get real. All right, so they definitely wanna tell you shit's about to get real. I might be locked up. I might be going to motherfucking jail. We also got cousin Pete, flesh and blood, or it could be something about a child or something like that. Mm -hmm. They want to tell you shit. I ride the short bus. And then we got influence. All right, Pisces. I feel like this person definitely want to tell you shit. Bitch, I'm going to be coming up with some sort of war story. Shit. Shut it up. Somebody going to try to sit down and tell you some long ass, bullshit ass story. But you already know the truth. So, yeah. We got a cry baby here. So somebody want to cry and booty me. That is not a good combination, honey. <laughs> all right, Pisces. I love you guys all so much. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace.